Everything is beautiful, beautiful morning and uh, looking forward to a wonderful race. <laughs> All building up to a crescendo but they're going to have fun, light and free. <laughs> it's looking tough but uh, we're ready, good day of fun, looking forward to it. It's looking like a beautiful morning when I drove in over the, through the gorge and the sun's coming up and it looks stunning day and I'm very excited. I can't say too much now, I'll we'll see along the course. Off you go! South African trail running champs! And there they go! Three, two, one, and off you go! Yeah, first of all, I just want to thank the, the race organizers for a well-organized event. Yeah, and I'm delighted to come back to Debs because this is my favorite uh, race. I think it will be a tradition for me to do it each and every year. First 10k I didn't feel so well. <laughs> I was a bit tired after the prologue. My buttocks was, was sore. So I just kept it easy at the start because uh, the guys were going back and front, forth. So I, I knew uh, they're, they're all going to blow up because everybody warned me about the second part of the race. So I, I just told myself, even, even, even if it doesn't feel fast, just go easy, just go easy. And I had to remind myself, myself a lot, just go easy and I know uh, Lucky and Tabang ran the course last year and they are the defending champs. So I just know these guys know how to pace, just stick with them. Uh, such a special race. Yeah, it's quite a tough, tough uh, race uh, with a lot of challenges, the climbs. But it's good to do it. Uh, we really enjoy it. But uh, I mean, what makes it special? The toughness of the hills. Yeah. It was extremely tough, I must say. Um, I'm trying to weigh up in my head if it's possibly the toughest route that I've ever run. Um, it's relentless. Lots of ups when you start climbing you think you yeah you're never gonna get there but at the same time it's absolutely beautiful and a lot of fun it's like a children's dream out there
I just kept a steady rhythm and there I, I, I actually know today if I if I run this smartly I can I can be the SA champ. Third to go, so next week it's just last time. Towards the the blockhouse, after second water point, that's where Juart left us. But then I kept telling Lucky that let's go, let's go, let's move. Then Lucky broke away towards uh, last water point. <laughs> to be honest, uh, Moloni is 100% technical. It undulates. It tests your strength. So if you fast. You must also have a technical skill. You must also be strong. So it doesn't mean that if you fast, you're going to win Molweni. No, it's a total no. You must have everything to be able to do well in Molweni. Five years I trained, years I trained hard, and I never imagined that I will be a trail champion in 2004-15. So it's a dream come true. But I'm so just so honoured and so blessed. All glory to God, eh? <laughs> Tough race, but uh, enjoyable. Today I was off the hook. To be honest, because I pulled my calf muscle at two oceans, so I wasn't training for almost four weeks now. But yeah, I'm glad I gave my best shot. I fought, though I was dragging myself, and at the end of the day, I managed to come third overall. Absolutely over the moon. I worked hard for this race. I'm feeling fantastic. I think I wanted the actual race win and title more than anything else. But of course, now that I'm qualified to go to World Champs, I'll give it absolutely everything I've got. Um, yeah, it was a tough run. I really enjoyed it. Lots of technical ups and downs, relentless route, really like <laughs> no flat sections to take a breather, take it easy. So it was hard on the legs. But um, I enjoyed the technical bits. Yeah, really a good race.
What I love about it from the beginning, it's a nice stretch. You, you can position yourself. But once it gets to the forest, it's technical, single track switchbacks. Then it takes you to the top. Then towards the finish, uh, I'm telling you, most, I think 100% of the, the field, they walk the last section. Because you climb a lot, you scramble, technicality, then towards the end, you have to drag yourself because you can't run last, last hill towards the end. Proper Bruce will run this, but it's beautiful. Eh? This is going to be the most, probably the most technical run I've ever done. The scenery, the landscape, where we've gone through, is absolutely spectacular. What a great event. It was just amazing to see those those views and to be so close to nature and to be blessed with this opportunity to run with friends because they are rivals but they are also friends because we we all need to need, need to cover the same distance so I've got so much respect for everybody for even for the last guy he still covers the same distance as me so so yes I'm just inspired by the people of the event it's really an ama amazing event Moloni is super technical it's a must do it's incredible absolutely incredible Unbelievable. Pretty awesome, man. It's awesome. <laughs>